Whether you have the best PC in the world or you have a genuinely budget-friendly PC, you will find yourself in a continuous loop of shutting down after launching The Last of Us Part 1. Well, you can somehow fix it. There are multiple things that you can try out to resolve this issue of PC shutting down after launching The Last of Us Part 1. Let's get started with them.1. Updating GPU Drivers The first thing that you can try out is updating the graphics drivers for your GPU. For NVIDIA, you can get the NVIDIA Experience and for AMD, you can get the AMD Adrenaline or Manual Driver install from their site. 2. Sync and FPS Cap The next thing that you can try out is disabling the sync and also putting a threshold to the FPS. It mostly depends on your specs whether the FPS should be 30, 45, 60, or more. 3. Changing DLSS You can mess around with DLSS, turning it off, performance, and even to balanced. The last one might fix your issue. 4. Let the shaders build. It might take an eternity, but let the shaders of the game build up. Usually, it will take more than 3 hours to even days, but it will be uploaded one day. You can wait and then play the game. 5. Checking power supply. The game is demanding and it could take your PC power to around 100%. At that point, the power supply should be supporting more than the max. After a stress test, you can know whether the power supply is the issue or not and then change it, getting more than the maximum your PC can draw. 6. Take the resolution down. If you are trying to play on a big screen with full HD resolution, take it down to HD or even less than that. Change the FOV as well here and put the settings down, especially the ones that take up your GPU usage. Well, that's how to fix PC shutting down after launching The Last of Us Part 1. You just have to worry about your PC VRAM and also the thermal throttling because it is the major cause of this issue.